Hey guys, it's Deadeye, and today we are the Soul Reaper in Cave Blazers, getting as far as we can in the game. I hope you enjoy. So something to stay aware of about the Soul Reaper in this game is that for every five kills I get in a row, without wasting too much time, I will be getting an extra one damage in either magic, ranged, or melee. Grab this. Ooh, actually that's pretty good. Give us a little bit of defense. The one main struggle as the Soul Reaper is that you don't spawn in with a bow. And without having a bow, <laughs> You really can't do a whole lot about the blue slimes. That one took care of itself, but a lot of them won't be doing that for us. So we're going to be really careful. And even with our ball and chain here, we're not going to be able to do much because that's still within the range of the blue slime. Come on. Come on. Got it. Okay, this way. Once I have a bow, I'll be able to take care of that one. But until then, we're out of luck. And down here, don't want to waste my souls. Oh, that counts as melee! Awesome! Okay. And then even when I have 10 here and I can no longer get any additional souls in terms of my boost, for every soul I get, I get a slight boost to melee and ranged. It's only temporary. Once I'm at 10, I can't get any more boosts in that, but I can continue to get magic and ranged and melee damage boosts that last permanently. So I want to be getting as many souls as possible, basically the whole game. It's, a, it's the main focus with just getting a bow <laughs> as being the secondary one. Because as soon as I have a bow, I'm basically, I'm not at a really almost any disadvantage anymore, and I just have a ton of advantages. I also have kind of low HP, 80 instead of 100, but it's not a massive deal. You sort of are always trying to up your HP in this anyway. <laughs> it's always gonna be a struggle, so it's not really a huge disadvantage for this character, I would say. Grab this spiked ring. Now we have two rings, the ruby ring, which increases max health. So see, we're already at the 100. That is the sort of base. Just gotta hope for a bow. We haven't gotten one yet in this level, but let's see if we can get one in the second level. Okay, yeah, again, blue slimes. If I had a bow right now, it wouldn't be an issue. Okay, they're hopping down. Hopping that way. Back up. Put that one down. Ugh. It's tough because I can't do anything about them. <laughs> okay, they're going that way. Fantastic. Got a rune. Got a bomb. I could potentially use the bomb to deal with them. Ooh, careful. Dull ring. Ooh, got some damage in on me, unfortunately. Okay. Ooh, dodge that. Got him. Spikes also do 160 damage, so not having a ton of health doesn't matter against them as much. Because <laughs> no matter what, you're kind of dealing with that. Try not to waste my souls here, because if you wait too long, you run out of them. And so, since it's only one bonus permanent boost, every five souls. You definitely want to not not waste any souls. Hand Blessing allows me to die once and be brought back. Super, super useful. So I will definitely be taking that. I don't have any duplicate items, so this duplication thing over here isn't useful, but that box, if it has a bow, it'll be entirely worth it to go and get it. So we're just going to have to do that. Okay. Oh, I got a hit. Crap. And no bow. It is what it is. I can get a boost from these guys. Good. Melee damage up. When I get those boosts, those melee damage up, whatever, that lasts for the entire game. <laughs> so it's really important that I get those, as many of them as I can, or as early as possible. It's just not worth it to use any of the potions. Got him. <laughs> I have two skull sticks. Oh, crap. I used a potion, and of course, it uh, decreases my melee and my ranged. Oops. I have two skull sticks. I could combine them at the combination thing, and I'd have a super skull stick, but I'm going to stick with the build I have. So that's another downside to this challenge, is I don't get to switch out swords, even when they're better. The Soul Reaper is what I will keep. Luckily, though, we can use this, get up to max health, and enter, try to fight the boss. Oh, gosh. I probably need a bow for this guy. This might be the end of this run. But I think this is a good run to sort of show off the limitations of my character. <laughs> Come on. Hit him. Hit him. Oh, I couldn't hit him. <laughs> This is just not right. <laughs> no bow makes this, like, impossible. Ooh. Okay. Oh, they can hit each other. That's good. I can't even reach him. He's just slightly too high up. Ah! You know, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Not a lot I can do about that one, but that's the big thing with this. You have to get a bow. All right, guys, this is the one, me and my soul stealer, and I actually just picked up at the very start here demonic prayer beads, which absorb the souls of nearby dead things. I, can I use this together? Like, I just want to see. See what happens if I get five souls, because they both have the effect of every five souls giving me a boost. Let me use the ability of it. Oh, 
You absorb souls like that. Okay, I'm dumb. <laughs> now I get it. Regeneration blessing. That seems like it could be pretty strong. And we got a bow as well. Store 10 health at the start of each new level. Mm, okay. So three arrows will cause extra damage with an explosion. Well, that'll be useful against the boss, to be sure. Master bow, though. Ooh, master bow does so much damage. I think I gotta go take the master bow instead. Okay, big monster guy. <laughs> That's a new one. Oh, he can break blocks. He's a Minecraft legend. <laughs> Let's try it. Five souls. Oh, what? None of the souls over here came to me? Ah, oh, hollowed bow. Yeah, I don't know about this particular magic item. I don't have any others right now anyway, so I guess it doesn't matter, but... Volatile Blessing, Glide Blessing, Fiery Blade. I like it. Chance of burning enemies to melee hits. Make the door. Okay, let's do it. See if I can get this Champion Blessing, the reward for this, which is, I think, melee uh, speed increase. Okay, three. Everyone come this way. I want to get all your souls. If everyone's in here, I feel like I can get a lot. Yes. Oh, crazy. Look how much that is. Yes. 110 damage. That's ridiculous. Give me the souls. Okay, I do need to eat that apple, though. The fire ones are a little dangerous. Actually, all these slimes are dangerous, dude. I am in such a good position right now, it's not worth it for me to risk myself at all. Got him. Get it. All these souls. That's so awesome. I've got so much damage coming out right now. From all this. Ho oh, oh. ho. Get these souls. Fetch me that souls. <laughs> got him. Okay, two hearts. Excellent. Okay, champion blessing. What does this do again? Melee attacks being increased by 10%. Heavy attacks stun targets. Temple approach. Ooh, and I got 10 health. Right, for every boss you beat. And that guy counts as a boss. Great. Yeah, I've, I've never really known for sure, so now I know. Poison affinity is not bad, but I already have fire. So getting extra fire. Enemies with fire increases your fire damage by 5%. Nice. Yeah, I feel like the soul stealing item is actually pretty good when put together with, uh, with this build because you can get double souls and just super boost everything. Blessing of Kings, and this one does, yeah, melee and range damage up. Not a substantial blessing, but nothing bad either. Don't know if I'll be able to get up there now, though. Ugh, now I want to. Okay, there we go. Now I can get in. Nice. Okay. Boost rune. Usable. Eats all of your active shields, gaining one melee, one ranged, one magic damage, and five max health for each shield eaten. So if I get any shields, I'll use this for sure, because that's just a ridiculous amount of boosting. Ruby ring. Ruby ring. Super ruby ring. Gives me 30 max health extra and some damage resistance. Wow. <laughs> Crazy, dude. Things are looking up. Just gotta be really careful so I don't mess up the run. That's good. Shield in there. I can use that to get stupid amounts of uh, bonus. Give me those souls. Use the shield rune and then exchange it for max health and other kinds of boosts. I'm not gonna be using the soul stealer in there probably. So let's take the boost band to boost attack speed and damage. Yeah, great. Okay. We'll use the boost band if we're able to. Let's see if we can do it. Oh, boy. Do what I can here. Every possibility this is gonna go real bad. Oh, okay. So I gotta time that jump. Now I know. Okay, he's gonna run at me. Shooting. That doesn't hurt me, which is good. Right? I don't think it does. Woo! That's a lot of damage to me. <laughs> Yikes. Okay, turns into a boss. Still got a decent amount of health. Wow, I do a lot of damage. Oh, he doesn't, he doesn't let you do that much damage. I did so much damage, the game was like, eh, I don't know about that. Seems a little OP to me. <laughs> okay, Life Drain Blessing. This is amazing. Killing enemy with melee restores two health. This is the run, dude. This is the run. This is awesome. Enemies have a chance of dropping an item. Okay, good. Actually, good. There's plenty of items that I could use. Hopefully healing items, especially. <laughs> But now that I have the melee drain ability, maybe I don't need it. <laughs> two health. Look at that, just two health for nothing. 
What did I do to deserve this? It's a trick question. Nothing. I already told you. Ooh, almost killed me. If that threw me the spikes, I would be a goner. That would be so upsetting. Okay. Okay. My friend is, uh... Is not so good at this game. <laughs> so we have another shield. I almost wish I had waited with the other shield so I could do double, but you know, it's okay. Yeah, I think we need to be bowing more now as they have like more health and stuff. I mean, when we can use melee, that's obviously great because we can get some health back, but okay, poison ring. Hmm. Yeah, poison ring, I think we switched to. In? Wow, yeah, we're getting pretty far. Level four. Might be able to get to the second boss here even. Okay, poison him. Got him. Okay. Another boost. <laughs> yeah, my damage just keeps going through the roof. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna run out of time in terms of souls. Restore 10 health and gain 10 maximum health at the start of... Oh, every time I beat a boss. Okay, cool. Or at the start of each level. Wow, nice. Not bad at all. Oh, my, my shield's gone. That's okay. Bit of a waste. That's alright, though. Well, yeah. It, it protected me a little bit. Some damage. I need, um... I need damage reduction if I can get it. Because I have high damage, but... And I am, you know, my max health is a little bit up. But not, like, substantially. So I'm a little bit vulnerable to just dying from attacks. <laughs> 156 damage, yeah. Like, that's, like, I don't want to talk about is, like, I'm almost a glass cannon. Just a little too much, that's what I'm saying. Crimson blade, yeah. Can't use any of these blades. Gotta stick with my current build, but I actually really like it, so I don't mind. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, that was insane. Okay, that was real not good for me. <laughs> oh, wait, I can get in here. Give me that. That is, like, awesome. Calamity perk, right? Is that the one I want? Larger, more powerful arrows might be the way to go. Much as the other ones are both good, the bosses usually I need to use arrows to fight. So to give myself the highest chance of success, like, immediately, that's what I gotta go for. Oh, yes, the spider. I love the spider. Give me a bomb. Where's a sticky bomb or something? Yeah, sticky bomb. Okay, got him. Get wrecked. <laughs> it's freaky, dude. Oh, crap. Let me up, let me up, let me up, let me up. Okay, poison up here is not good. Put this back on. Oh, I've never seen that. That was wild. Okay, get up to him. Use this. Give me those souls. What? No souls? Oh, these guys don't count. They don't have souls. <laughs> okay. I mean, I know they don't have souls, but like, I was expecting I could use them to like, boost myself. My mistake. So we get repair blessing. We take more than 12 damage, recover five health. So reduce damage down by five, basically. Do five damage to any melee attackers. Okay. Hey, you know what? We already have such great perks. I think we'll be able to make it all the way up to the next boss, as long as I'm kind of careful. But again, I, I've never been this far, so <laughs> we'll see how it goes. It's really good that I'm getting 10 extra max health every run, though, every time I go to a new area. So that's, yeah, that's super lucky. Okay, got them down. Oh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. Ah, oh, I got poisoned. Yeah, this is kind of just an awkward spot to start. I, I don't really have any line of sight on anybody. Oh, crap. Let him jump. Got him. Just gotta recover some health here. Ooh, ruby band. Nice, we have two of those now. Might actually be worth it to combine them then. <laughs> a lot of damage, to be sure. That was a little wild, but we managed. Give me those souls. Oh, their souls only linger for so long. <laughs> oh, crap, crap, I didn't know that would happen. Oh no. Oh wait, but I recover, good. No! Uh, it sucks they don't get stunned when you slash them. I was thinking I would slash him and it would knock him out of his thing, but no. All right, but I hope you guys enjoyed that one. Consider letting me know in the comments or leaving a like if you did, and I will see you in the next video. Bye now.